Ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls, I'm the king, and welcome back to the channel. As you can read by the title, some more interesting news about the next chapter, which isn't too far away. We're going to get the PTP in about three or four weeks, so it's already November 1st. Well, today's Halloween. Tomorrow's November 1st, and then we're going to get our first teasers, the PTP. It's, it's a lot of stuff that we're going to get. Currently going on in the game, we already have a lot of stuff. We have to rift. We have the archives, we have double blood points, we have the Halloween event, so many things going on right now and there's even more information to add on top of that. Before I continue with the video as we always do, I have two quick announcements, you're free to fast forward. The first one is we are currently doing a giveaway for the Rift Pass. This is going to end on Monday so if you want to enter the link is down below. Click on the gleam, you'll see all the steps there and you can follow through. In addition to that, we're also going to be doing some more giveaways on our Twitch channel where we are going to be live. I'll put the schedule right here, normally I'm always live when I upload these videos but we just actually finished being live so I'll put the schedule for when we're going to be live for tomorrow and the days following. Now that we got the announcements out the way let's talk about these leaks what does it mean for the game so I was spammed by this by everyone I was tagged in so many tweets and I actually seen this first from Stabby Myers he's always a good source for our information and then I seen everyone tagging me on leaks by daylight so I'm going to show you guys little snippets of the things that I received and we're going to try to put things together so the first thing that you guys need to understand if you don't really know how dead by daylight coding works because I don't expect you to all of the chapters have a code name and this code name is is normally a country so every code name it has nothing to do with it it's just the country name and that's the way they titled their uh, stuff so this one is actually called Sweden we know that because in the game files there is a file called Sweden but besides that there was a lot of information in the Sweden file so the killer code as I said is called Sweden there's no significance to that you can't really draw anything from that because all of the ones that we received in the past literally meant nothing now going through the code there are quite a few things that stand out here first of all some of the coding says grunt arm and grunt attack so these are just sound effects that we're going to hear maybe this killer is going to have their hand as their weapon similar to the tag we don't really know there's also more sound effects for the in-game start the menu and there's two things that i've noticed here one thing is called normal so that's when the killer is just being normal you're just regularly walking around doing whatever and then for the other code names we have crazy so it seems that this killer is going to flip in between two, kind of like tier 3 Myers, but instead of stealth, they're going to be crazy. So we don't actually know what crazy means. If you think about crazy, the first thing that comes to my head is that they're going to run around super quick or something. I have no idea what it means. Now what's interesting is that if we look more into the code, there is a line that says one shot. Now one shot, it's pretty self-explanatory. It seems that the killer is going to go into this crazy mode and they're going to be able to one-shot the survivors. Is this going to be like Ghostface? Is this going to be like Myers? We don't know. We know nothing about it, but it looks like the new ability is going to be one-shot. There's also a code called infinite. I think this is just an audio file that just loops over and over and over. Now, people have been tweeting me this all the time, and they said crazy matches with Pennywise. I'm still not fully on that boat of Pennywise. Now, a big thing that I've been looking into was that Matthew Cote did confirm that the teacher files are going to be used somehow. And we have access to some of those teacher's files because they were here before the nurse even came out and they're still into the game today. So I'm thinking maybe this can be the teacher. Maybe this is still going to somehow incorporate the teacher file somehow and we're going to get the teacher as the killer. Now, a lot of people are also saying from what I've seen from tweets that Sweden is where the actor of Pennywise is from, so this is a big hint. I honestly think we might be tying loose ends here, but who knows? Maybe this actually can be Pennywise and I'm wrong and you're going to look at this video and you'll be like, wow, King, you are so wrong. Who knows? This is the new leaks that we have. As we know, we should be receiving some teasers coming down later on in this month as today is or tomorrow is going to be November 1st. And we're most likely going to see this chapter coming out in December, two weeks prior, which should be late November, or early December. We should start seeing like all of the things for the chapter. So that's pretty damn exciting. And as I said, we have so much things currently going on in Dead by Daylight. It's like 
we get flooded with it and I, I love it so much. And one more thing about the power, it does have some more text lines and one of them says charge. So it looks like you'll need to charge your power up, whether that's stalking survivors or just looking at them or whatever way you charge it. Maybe it's a secondary objective kind of deal. Who knows? But that's all the information that I have for you guys about this new killer and what that could potentially mean for the game. So we know that it's called Sweden, has the ability to one shot or the power name is one shot and it has two modes, normal and crazy. So that's pretty interesting. Make what you will of that and let me know what you guys think about it in the comments below. As always, I'm the king. I tip my crown to you guys. Make sure you check out the giveaway and you come over to Twitch tomorrow. Today was a lovely stream. So I look forward to seeing a lot of new faces tomorrow as well. We'll see you guys in the fog. Enjoy the archives and take care.